show you how to do a basic ab crunch on the ball, but with perfect good technique that will keep tension on your abs the entire time. It will also put your obliques and your core in a position where they're consistently working as well. There are two different stages, so let's go through stage one. The first thing I want you to do is to simply sit on top of the ball. Once you're directly on top of the ball, take a big step out with both your feet, keeping your feet nice and wide apart. This will keep you stable. From there, simply roll your bottom forward, sitting back on the ball. Place your hands behind your head. Simply roll back on the ball until you can feel your stuff, body start to fall off the back. Keep yourself in balance. From there, chin up, exhale on the way up, inhale on the way down. Try to take your chin to the ceiling. This is cheating. Chin to the ceiling. Stage two slightly makes things a little bit more difficult. From here, you want to incorporate more balance and control, getting the obliques and core to work more efficiently. What now I want you to do is bring your feet together. Knees also come together. Big step forward and roll back down. From here, hands go behind the head. Again, roll back as far as you can. You've got one rep up after another. The first rep goes chin to the ceiling. The other, touch the chin. In the second exercise, I wouldn't consider it cheating because of the balance and control involved. As you tuck your chin and go through a greater range of motion, your internal cord and your obliques get to work that little bit harder. It's always under tension and therefore it's not cheating because your feet are together, creating balance, making your abs work harder. Okay. 